most disturbing thing is that the boys you bring are not boys we can beat our chest and say they are the best. I can assure you there are local players here when they are properly trained I use the word properly trained will outclass them because most of the boys either they are playing for third division clubs and most of them even are bench women so they, they, they never feature in any game now you have a man like is it Richard Lamptey of Kotoko such a brilliant footballer hard working footballer who has been called to the to, to, to the who have been called to come and the coach foolishly refused to feature him because that's the only way you can test the local boy and see whether he's good and i can assure you if that boy had taken part of the match yesterday he would have been outstanding that's why i say we have problems and the problems are problems that can only be solved by government focusing very seriously on sports in this country. At the moment, we it seems we have lost everything. Boxing, we are nowhere. Athletics, we are nowhere. Football, the main passion of the nation, we are nowhere. Uh, Doc, you seem to have so much confidence in Richmond Lamptey. Um, people believe the local terrain or our local league is not strong enough for our stars to fight toe to toe with the players from these foreign leagues. Why are you so much in tune with the, the 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 play and style of Richmond Lamptey to the extent that you believe his presence will do so much good to the Black Stars? It's not a question believing that his presence will do much for the Black Stars. The boy is an intelligent football. I've watched his game several times. In fact, many a time people get even amazed that I am a, a big, uh, what do you call it, uh, man in house of hope. I keep on pushing that. Look, I am very objective in life. You follow me? That boy, if he can get a good trainer, will go far. And this is the time. Now, if the coach were a bit wise, he would have tested him for even 15 minutes and see. But I didn't feature him at all. Because if you try him, you will get to know his capabilities. Secondly, you are giving him a platform, well platform. And thirdly, you are building his confidence in international matches. The coach was not able to do this. I was really surprised. You follow me? Because if you did that, I do. he performs well. I tell you, we have players in this, this country who, when they are trained, as I was telling you, Kwame Nkrumah's time, I was a kid, but I remember some of the people. People like Dogomoru, people like Kwame Adakwa, people like Infum, people like Adodamiti. People like Aduda, I'm mixing Kotoko and Asofo because they were the, the key players. People like Doduangra, goalkeeper. Keep, I mean, you can call them. Many, many. You come to Kotoko also as a Bibuachi, a Babayara, and others. This is this, this, Salisu. I mean, these were great footballers. You follow me? I but do. They were brought under the control of a good coach who knows what exactly he wants. And he. He, he made them to be great. Why can't we do it now? These were all local players. Okay. The first of all, they should have that um, love for the nation that will push them to the next level. Absolutely. I mean, without this, look, this is international competition. Have you ever watched carefully? Have you ever watched carefully when Germans are playing matches? When Germans yeah. are playing matches, yeah. eh? when Germans are playing matches, they play football as if they are at war with you. Okay. You put on you, you don't take this time to watch some of this thing. A German in any international feature to him is a war. We know all we know Germans have always war minded. Mm -hmm. 
since the time of Kaiser and uh, Adolf Hitler. Germans, any game that they are playing, you watch it, that, that I'm telling you, you watch it. To them, it's war. So they will kill themselves. One back when I was in this country, we had a discussion. And he even mentioned that to me. You follow me? So, please, if you don't have that feeling that this country believes for me that I'm dying for this country on this speech, then forget about it. All those I saw yesterday, they were all careful about their, their legs. Hmm. There are no boys who will die for the country. So for me, you can't get them now. There is no nationalism. Do you follow me? Yeah, I do. I'm not just in football. I do. The entire sporting fraternity in Ghana, it is to, look, can you believe we used to play? Okay. Uh, uh, sir, bef before we end the conversation, um, um, any New Year message for Hat to Folk fans? We can't have an interview with you and exclude your, your favorite and um, your followers when, when it comes to Hat to Folk affairs. Do you have any New Year message for them and any promise um, that you are going to tell them ahead of 2024 and um, the beautiful things you, you've made available for them? Oh, yes, definitely has a full support. I have been with supporters for years. I know them. I know their temperament. They have every right uh, to uh, uh, to get annoyed when we are not winning matches. But they shouldn't forget also that it is also painful for leadership when we don't when we lose matches. Because we do anything that can be done for the boys will pay higher than any club in this country if our technical staff get higher pay our coach or coaches are well paid well housed okay we are putting a lot of infrastructures you should come and see our academy at the moment how it looks like come and see our commercial center come and see our new headquarters so we are really focused on uplifting the club okay yes we have not been performing well what we expect as house of folk is not coming but i believe strongly that that will come soon in the next leg that we are going to start okay. and i can assure them mm -hmm. that very soon we shall have a substantive coach okay that that means um hard to folk will have a substantive coach in, in the I coming think. days yes we shall definitely have a substantive coach okay that means that there's a plan to fix the technical department of hard to folk it won't be an interim manager till the end of the season yeah that's why i say we are going to have a substantive coach. whoever will be there on the technical board must be substantive okay okay and and there will be some some additions, some some stars from other Premier League clubs joining Hard to Folk. Is that is that something that you expect? What do you mean by that? I'm talking about transfers. What Hard to Folk? There will be transfers. Okay. And then the one who are negotiating. Okay. Okay.